All right, so how do we generate a Google Gemini API key? So the first thing I'm going to do is go to google.com and I'm going to search for Gemini API key. And then I'm going to click on this first link here and it brings me to um, this area. So I'm going to click the blue get an API key button and then it'll ask me to log in. If you have an account with Google, go ahead and log in. If you don't, go ahead and create an account. I do have an account, so I'm going to go ahead and log in. All right, so once you're logged in, you're going to want to go ahead and accept the terms, and then we're going to click on this get API key. And once again, if and if you have any API keys available, um, you shouldn't. If you've just created an account, they would be listed here. Um, we're going to click this create API key button and we're going to accept a safety reminder. And it's going to ask you to create a project or create API key in a new project. If you have an existing project, you can go ahead and search for it here or let's just go ahead and create API key in new project. All right, so it's generated our API key. So now we're gonna copy that and save it somewhere safe. So that's the API key that we generated. And that's how you generate an API key for uh, Google Gemini. And as you can see, this is the free um, tier. If you wanted to set up billing for it, you can go ahead and do so. Um, but for use with Metaphoto AI, there is no need to set up an, a paid account. It will handle the rate limits um, gracefully.